my best whiskey to experience has to be Glenfarclas. Now there was four of us, but our tour guide, and I can't remember the name, was fantastic. She said at the beginning, you know, like, I'm not gonna teach granny how to suck eggs, but the information she gave us was super interesting. Now going around the distillery is wicked because her knowledge was great. The tasting room they have is taken from um, an old ship. So anyway, doing the tastings and they, they pull out the bottles, they had the Glen Farkless 15, 17, 21, the Glen Farkless 105. Sarah, that was her name. So she goes to the back and she brings a trolley with four more bottles. First one is a Glen Farkless family class from 2000. Taste it, beautiful drown. Then the next three bottles didn't even have a label on. One of them had a printed label and the other two had post-it notes taped onto them. 1993 Glen Farkless. It's nearly as old as I am. I was born in 92. Next was from 1967. And at this point, we're all looking at each other like, pfft, mind blown. Like the, the events that this whiskey has gone through whilst aging is insane. And to be able to try it as well. And then after that, 1956 Glenfarclas. And whether you like the flavors or not, to be able to experience something that's, that's nearly 70 years old, I just felt super privileged to be there. But yeah, in terms of whiskey distilled experience, Glenfarclas, I'd highly recommend the Connoisseur's Tour.